Hi there, I'm Ellie from Smart Apps for Kids and I'm going to show you a demo of what this app looks like on the inside. When you've seen enough, click this icon at any time during the video to read more about this it my or to download it from the App Store. For kids. Here we go. How do you want to see your weather? Do you want to use Fahrenheit or Celsius? Well, welcome to This Is My Weather, Meteorology for Kids. We can choose either Fahrenheit, Fahrenheit. or Celsius. Celsius. I'm going to show you first. We can change this at any stage. I work in Celsius because I live in Australia. And this is actually set up. Pick a friend to show you your weather. To find my weather. So let's find a friend. These are brilliant apps, by the way. I've already done the This Is My Body app. And they're really well put together. So let's pick this friend. What should I wear in this weather? So currently... Hey, it's raining! I'm getting wet! <laughs> currently she has a frowny face and it is 25 degrees and it's raining. So we have got in this box the headgear we need for rain. So let's flip through. No earmuffs. No, you don't need a scarf. You do need a rain hat. What else have we got in? And the shirts. Hmm. Uh, hmm. You don't want a big warm jacket. Would you like a dress? Would you like a raincoat? There's another raincoat, a yellow one. Let's have a look in the pants. She doesn't need any pants. But she's wearing a dress, but she needs some shoes, maybe some gum boots. No, here we go. Great! I'm not getting wet! There we go. She's very pleased about that, but we could go back. And I've just pressed the little cloud, and we can go to info, and it's currently set up to my weather, but I can set my own weather. So I can make it brr, freezing cold and raining. What do you think? Freezing cold and raining? Let's do that. Would it be raining if it was freezing cold? So let's go back and do the weather today. Oh, actually, I'll do it in Fahrenheit for you as well, because I Why know a lot I of you work in, in Fahrenheit. Weather? Oh, that's super duper cold. Let's change it. See down the bottom here? We can change it to Fahrenheit at any stage. How do you want to see there Fahrenheit? So let's do that. And now we can go and do my weather today. What should I wear in this weather? In the freezing weather. And, uh, all right, so let's do find some headgear. Some earmuffs? Yep. She's still not smiling yet. I'm freezing. Oh, she's very cold. Uh, what about for your body? Would you like, let's get rid of your raincoat and your dress. Oh, we just got rid of you. Oh, her nose is drippy. Sorry, we need your scarf back. Somehow we flipped your scarf off. Come here, scarf. Aha. And let's find she can wear an undershirt or wear a nice warm jacket. There we go. What about for pants? Are they long enough? Let's take her gum boots off. Does she need some leggings under those pants? Do you think she'll be warm enough now? Let's uh, find some shoes. No, not swimming pants. They're not going to be warm enough. They're not going to be any good. Oh, I just threw away the warm shoes. Come on, let's go back through all of these shoes. Gum boots. Can you see the warm woolly shoes? Here yeah, they are. There we go. Are Great. you warm now? There we go. She's warm. Let's go on and have a look. Spring. So we have four seasons and different bubbles to catch on them. So spring. Summer. Fall. Winter. And you can see these little dots down here show us. So let's start at winter seeing as how we are here. Let's tap the igloo. Snow crystals are always symmetrical and six-sided. Every snowflake is individual and all of the different shapes are caused by temperature and moisture. While they travel from the clouds down to us, the crystals flow through different layers of air temperatures. That's how differently shaped crystals are added and the shapes keep changing. Now, at, see this little star? It means there are more things to find on this page. So I can tap the igloo. Ooh, there we go. And now... We've got a soap bubble, soap bubble game, and we'll go back, and I can tap the polar bear, 
and down here if you wish to see the text that's just been read aloud here it is you can scroll up well you can't scroll up with that one but you can scroll up with others and you'll get more information as well so there we go we've had a look at snow crystals let's go back by pressing the cross and let's let's pick one more in snow let's pick the snowman Snowflakes are made up of lots of tiny crystals. On warm days, they are big and sticky. On cold days, the snow is fine and powdery. So, hmm, let's roll our snowball over here to the right. I'm pulling it over. And up the hill, there we go. And here's the rest of our snowman. So, move over buttons. Here we go, middle, top, a saucepan hat. A broom, uh, a carrot nose, a lovely smile, one eye, some buttons, and the other eye. Great! And our star has turned into some more information. Record size snow. Record size is snow. Snowflakes can be as big as popcorn. And you tap the text to have it read aloud to you. That's very handy. Okay, let's go and have a look at its work. Well, after fall, after, summer, after spring, winter comes spring. So let's let's start with spring. Let's go to hmm, the wind. If the fog is very thick, oh, this one's you the can fog. barely see your own hands in front of your eyes. Here we go. Here's your thick fog. That wasn't the one I thought it was. The wind down here with the washing. Actually, this isn't the wind either. This is... <laughs> okay, you'll find out. The sun warms water everywhere in the world. Light drops of water rise with warm air as invisible water vapor. So if I tap the water, up it goes. If I tap the washing, up it goes. And, and is invisible water vapor going up and creating more clouds up there in the sky. Did you see another cloud appear? Lots of clouds appearing. You get that... Single Ooh. water particles cool, move closer together and merge. They get heavier and heavier and finally fall on the earth as rain. What happens if I... The ocean them? and rivers oh. absorb the rain again and part of it soaks into the ground. It collects in groundwater and serves as the water supply for plants animals and people. This happens again and again. That's how water is always part of a cycle. Look at that. Let's tap our little test tube. There we go. That's a little activity you can do yourself. And just having a look. Look. This is what we just had read aloud to us. So you can go and look at the text at any stage. Let's go back. We'll go back by pressing the cross. Though you can see pressing the cloud gives you a sidebar so you can go directly anywhere you want to go. Summer. Let's go and make some thunder, hey? Or some lightning. Because the lightning makes the thunder. I know Thunderstorms that. Thunderstorms are predicted when there are big dark clouds and storms. Because I listen to the app. Why are there flashes and thunder? Cold and warm air is whirled wildly in the clouds. Drops of water and ice crystals fling against each other. This produces energy, electricity. There is a spark, lightning. The hot lightning shoots at high speed through the cold air down to the ground. The air is heated and expands quickly with a loud boom. Shall we make some lightning? We need to stack. Stack the clouds. Let's do it again. Let's do it again. Can we get the car. Oh, what about the electricity lines? Don't really want to hit those lightning, do we? All right, that's enough fun lightning. Let's go back. I'm sure there's more to discover there. I just haven't discovered it yet. Let's go to this little house with the swing. the sun moves around the earth once each day. In reality, the earth turns around once every day and so does the house where you live. 
All right, yeah, let's use this slider in the middle to turn the earth around. You can see your house up there. The sun's going across and it's night time. There, and we've unlocked another activity. And you can have a look at that yourself. Let's go and have a look at what's after summer, autumn, I hear you say. Let's go and see fall. autumn or fall. All right, let's have, this one's the wind one that I thought I was looking at in spring. Wind blows at different intensities. It is measured by its speed. The wind scale measures values by zero to 12. Okay, so down here we have a gauge. We can pull it along. Light wind breathes. Light wind breathes. And you can see. Light wind breathes. See the chimney. Strong uh -oh. wind. That tree looks. Storm. Oh, there goes somebody's hat. Somebody's hat. Oh, there goes the tree. And we've unlocked. Light wind breathes. A little Eskimo here by the look of it. Blizzards are storms with strong winds and large amounts of snowfall. They occur when the temperature is very low and winds last a long time. Let's go back and a froggy appears. How come? Let's tap him. Sometimes cyclones over water suck fish or frogs up into the air and carry them along. Well, there you go. Let's they eventually fall one. back to the ground. Woo. Strong wind. All right. <laughs> I could stay here all day playing with the wind. Let's do one more. Let's do the clouds. Clouds are divided by their appearance and the altitude where they float. There are high, mid-level, and low clouds. You can often tell what the weather will be like in a few hours by looking at the clouds. Try it yourself. Okay, here's a... Zero cumulus clouds. Let's scroll along. Cumulus clouds. Cumulonimbus clouds. Ooh, what's his elephant? How heavy are the clouds? How heavy are the clouds? A nice big cumulus cloud weighs as much as 18 elephants. Holy moly. A thick dark rain cloud weighs as much as 9,000 elephants. That's a lot. My goodness me. All right, there you are. Zero cumulus now, cumulus clouds. So you've seen already that if I tap the little cloud on the side, we can scroll through nice and easily here. And you can see I've unlocked some things, but not all of them. So there are more things to investigate in here. This is an excellent little app and an easy one for kids to learn about meteorology and their weather. I love it. Now don't go without clicking on our Smart Apps for Kids links for great reviews, free apps every single day and the best giveaways.